How to check your internet speed. 1. Open your browser. 2. Type www.speedtest.net and press enter. 3. Click the go button. The speed test will start automatically. 4. Wait for the test to complete to see your download and upload speeds. Try other websites for internet speed tests. Visit websites for internet speed tests. Always visit reliable websites for internet speed tests. You can find other links websites for internet speed tests in the description. What is an ISP? ISP stands for Internet Service Provider. ISPs, or Internet Service Providers, allow your devices, like computers, smartphones, etc., to connect with the Internet. ISPs, or Internet Service Providers, are companies or organizations that enable your device with Internet access. Without an Internet Service Provider or ISP, individuals and organizations would be unable to access the Internet or engage in online activities. There are three levels of Internet Service Provider, ISP Tier 1 ISP, Tier 2 ISP, and Tier 3 ISP. Tier 1 ISP these ISPs are at the top of the hierarchy and they have a global reach. These are the largest ISPs in the world, with extensive global networks. They provide Internet to Tier 2 and Tier 3 ISPs. Tier 1 ISPs typically provide the highest speeds and reliability. They own and operate a vast portion of the Internet's infrastructure and do not rely on other ISPs for Internet. Tier 1 ISPs control the main Internet connections around the world. Tier 2 ISPs are smaller companies that rely on Tier 1 ISPs to connect to the Internet. Tier 2 ISPs depend on Tier 1 ISPs to connect to the global Internet. Tier 2 ISPs often operate in specific regions or countries. Tier 3 ISPs are the smallest companies that provide Internet to local areas and depend on Tier 1 and Tier 2 companies for their connections. Tier 3 ISPs usually provide services to specific towns, cities, or regions. Tier 3 ISPs depend on Tier 1 or Tier 2 ISPs for Internet connectivity. What factors does Internet speed depend on? Internet speed is how fast data moves between your device and the web. Internet speed refers to how quickly data is transmitted over the Internet. Bandwidth is defined as the maximum amount of data that can be transferred over your connection. The higher the bandwidth, the faster your Internet connection. Latency refers to the time taken for data to travel. Lower the latency means the faster your Internet connection. ISP throttling is when your internet service provider slows down your internet speed. Signal strength. The stronger the signal means, the faster your internet connection. Being far from your Wi-Fi router weakens the signal. Device performance. Older or slower devices can also decrease internet speed. The latest router and latest device can boost internet speed. Network congestion. The internet can be slower when lots of people are online at the same time. More people using the same network can slow down internet speed. Server issues. If the server is slow or overloaded, your download e-upload speeds may be affected. 
choosing the right ISP is important for faster internet. Compare different types of internet connection in terms of speed. Different types of internet connections provide different speeds. Fiber optic offers the fastest speeds. Fiber optic internet is used by businesses, homes, data centers, telecom companies, and schools for fast, reliable internet and data transfer. A cable connection uses the same wires as cable TV to give you the internet. A cable connection can slow down when many people are using it at once. DSL, digital subscriber line, is generally slower than fiber or cable. Digital subscriber line, DSL, depends upon distance from the provider's infrastructure. Wi-Fi depends on the underlying connection. Wi-Fi converts internet connections into wireless signals for devices. Wi-Fi can provide high speeds but vary significantly. Satellites may offer lower speeds. The satellite internet uses satellites to provide internet in distant and isolated places. It's slower and can be affected by the weather. Cellular networks can offer high speeds but vary significantly based on location and how many people are using the network. Broadband over power lines, BPL uses electrical power lines for internet. BPL utilizes existing power lines, but speeds can be inconsistent and affected by electrical interference and distance from the transformer. Dial up uses a phone line. Dial-up are very slow and outdated. Fixed wireless. Uses radio signals to connect homes to the internet. Speed can vary. The connection quality can be influenced by distance and obstacles like trees or buildings. ISDN Integrated Services Digital Network. ISDN offer moderate speed. ISDN is reliable for voice. ISDN is not used as much today. How can I make my internet connection faster? Tips for faster internet. Choose a reputed ISP. Upgrade your plan with your ISP. Use a wired connection, Ethernet. Position your router centrally away from obstructions. Disconnect unused devices. Update your modem and router. Keep your router away from devices like microwaves and cordless phones. Minimize interference from appliances. Clear your browser's cache regularly. Scan for viruses to ensure security. Adjust settings to prioritize important traffic. Restart your router periodically. If it's still slow, contact your ISP. Why choosing the right ISP is important for faster internet connection. Choosing the right ISP is important for faster internet. Different ISPs offer different speeds. Selecting an ISP that provides higher speed packages can directly impact your internet performance. The quality of an ISP's network infrastructure affects speed. ISPs with advanced infrastructure, such as fiber optic networks, tend to offer faster and more reliable connections. Network congestion happens when too many people are using the internet at the same time. Some ISPs offer slower speeds at the time many people are using the internet. ISPs with strong networks can only provide fast speeds at the time many people are using the internet. Lower the latency means the faster your internet connection. Some ISPs have lower latency. ISPs may offer different speeds based on your location.
Choosing the best ISP provides high-speed internet service in your area. ISP throttling is when the ISP slows down your internet speed after certain data usage. Choosing an ISP with fair policies is important for a faster internet. ISP customer support helps in fixing internet-related problems quickly. Choosing the right ISP can give you a better internet experience. How do I choose an ISP? Type in ISPs in your city area into the Google search bar. This can show you local ISPs and their locations. Visit those ISP websites. Check their service areas, plans, and pricing. Look for ISPs that provide high speed plans. Research the ISP's customer service reputation. Online reviews and ratings can provide insights into ISP support quality. Look for reviews and ratings of the ISPs regarding their service reliability and speed. Search for reviews by typing ISP name reviews into Google. If you have questions, Contact the ISPs directly through their websites. Understand ISP contract lengths and termination fees. Choose reputed ISP. If you find this video useful, if you find this video informative, hit the like button. Your likes are very precious. Your likes are very valuable. Like this video.